The following reaction coordinate diagram represents a reaction of A to form G. Let's start off with the first question, A, how many intermediates are formed? Now remember an intermediate is pretty much a middle step, and the way to identify this on a diagram is by looking at the bottom of this little hill. So looking at the bottom portion here, there's gonna be two intermediates, C and E. And it could also look something like this if we have multiple steps in our reaction. We know that again, the bottom of this hill would have been the intermediate. This is just a different example. Also note that the top of this hill is our transition state. Now let's move on to part B, which is asking us to figure out the letters that represent the transition states. So again, those are the ones that are at the top of the hill. We have three of them. So this would have been B, D, and F. Now to make this question easier, let's actually label everything that we have. So we already said that we found the intermediates, which were C and E. We found the transition states, which I can abbreviate as TS, and there was three of them. Because this reaction starts with A, that's our reactant, to form G, that's our product. 